Hey guys, Mr. Lizard King here with Mission 5 of Grand Theft Auto Vice City. It's the first one proper for Avery. There he is. Uh, We're going to go to a golf course and beat a guy up with a golf club. Um, again, that's just how, just how Tommy rolls, really. Uh, yes, this guy is building some property and guy at the golf course is pissing him off so we're gonna go beat him up um, but yeah just get rid of him free up, the, free up some space for Avery to do his dirty deeds um, that's what we're gonna do mission 5 these these are still we're starting to get out of the tutorial missions now and to the main missions really. Um, so let's get over. Oh, look at that cutscene again. We well, have to go and get our uh, sexy golfing clothes, which is by no way stereotypical of a golfer. Look at that. Nice ass baby. Back the car, Tommy. And yeah, when you go to these, these store, Raphael's in the last mission, um, the golf store, all that sort of things, they all become open so you can go back and uh, visit again if you should ever need um, a pair of tartan trousers for anything testing out my golf buggy skills here as we head across to the driving range which by the way is facing water how are they getting those golf balls back that's what I want to know. And is there any... Pardon me, is there any driving ranges in the world that face out over water? Look at that shot there, yeah. Um, if so, um, let me know in the comments because it seems um, an awful waste of golf balls. Anywho, uh, we've been beating up the, uh, the minders bouncers security team and he's left i'm going to cut a cutscene here because i spend about four minutes chasing him around the golf course till he eventually decides to uh, start heading towards the the exit i don't think you can kill him in the golf course you have to go through this uh, this chase um, back outside, and what have you. Uh, watch for the security guards. Um, and just, I forgot, I forgot to put my gun up, which is unfortunate. And then, yeah, we're going to have to chase him. The, he just left his door hanging there. Which is unfortunate. Just got away from that guy there. And yeah, um, let's, just, let's just cut through this. About another two minutes of chasing. I've swapped cars as well. And we eventually get him trapped. Uh, about two miles away uh, and I decide just to nudge him into this little driveway type thing and then it's all over I get back out and uh, pretty much show him who's the boss of the golf club again and yeah him and his bouncers die a little jump over the cars like that well, I hit one, two, job done, run away, don't I die, mission done, mission five, Griffith, I say, over, bye.